people, welcome back to Necroid Gaming, uh, Necroid TV, sorry. Uh, my name is Necroid, and time to play Hogwarts Legacy. We have to meet Professor Weasley. Wonder why? Professor Weasley? Professor Weasley? Hmm. Somewhere away from prying eyes. Oh, is that the room of secrets? Requirements? Oh, my lord. Forgive me, the headmaster stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. I see you've wasted no time. Well done. Shall we? After you, Professor. Oh, what a gentleman. Room of requirements, yo. You dirty dog. What is this place? This is the Room of Requirement. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, a student might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. If ever. It is a mess in here. I to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. Uh -huh. But you can to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now. Where is Deke? You must have sneaked past. Oh, Deke can get in here. Deke, Professor. The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. Depulsor. Maybe. There's oh. No chance I'm clambering over this mess. Well, I tried something, but... This presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco. Evanesco. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. Interesting. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. Ooh, look at that. Evanesco! Okay, Evanesco, where are you? Right there. Um, we'll do right there for now. Splendid. Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs. Yes, ma'am. Excellent. <gasps> You'll know wow. the possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Let's move on. It's for green. Amazing. <laughs> where in Merlin's name is that elf? I'm where hiding. Ooh, hold on, Professor Weasley. Goodness. Hold on, hold on. Old school bag. I waited for you here for ages. Perhaps we assigned a few more inches of parchment that you expected. Let me know if you want to try again to see this tea. I'll take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Oh, sure. Yes, I'll, I'll definitely check around. Definitely check around. Oh. Some of us are trying to rest. You've been resting for ages. What are you talking about, girl? Oh, my lord. Oh! Okay, then. Okay, number two. All right, you're coming with me, buddy. There you go. Oh, there's something to do here, too. Ew, an old ass coffee. Wait, can I go underneath there? Ah, I see. Wait, can I just push it? Oh, I can. I'm gonna cheat my way out. There we go. There we go. Ooh, a chesty. I like myself some chesties. 
Uh, number F1. There we go. Hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. An intruder! Stop them! Uh, I'm not an intruder. I'm allowed to be here. No, not. Uh, that's not helpful, you worthless pirate. <laughs> <laughs> I'll repair you. I'll repair you. Oh, you can't. That sucks. Oh my lordy lord. Need some cutting. Do I get anything from it? No. Okay. A toilet. A random toilet in here. Okay then. Be offended to the room top. I need a bath. Cheeky thing. <laughs> I love this game. Oh, look at how beautiful it is. <laughs> Something's gonna happen here. How does anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? Ooh, an, an harp. Can I play it? And it's not really doing a good job playing it. What was that? A key! Was that a golden stitch? Hi! Where are you? Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> Whoa! Okay then. Accio. There we go. Really? I cannot go through there. Come on. There you go. Happy now? You fat bastard. I just heard it again. Wait, what am I supposed to do with this? Okay, that's a mini game. I wonder. I wonder. I wonder. No? Uh huh. Akio. I can access it now. I can. Why? Well, it was letting me. There we go. Oh my God! Oh. Who are you? I hope that house elf can find us in here. It is huge, this room. And a lot of supplies. Uh oh, something's gonna happen here. Oh, look, the house elf. Yikes! Careful! Huh? Oh, there you are. Wait right there. Deke will come to you. <sighs> Hello. Ah, oh, Deke. We've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed it is. Deke is honored to meet you. Deke Honor to meet you too. Friend since I was a second year. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. The room of requirement will always be equipped for the seeker's needs. Okay. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deep seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as the room of hidden things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Yeah, but it's quite a mess in here. Now, 
It's time to focus on what you need. Naked girls, naked girls, naked girls. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. Well, that's a lot better. You've given yourself quite a canvas to work with. That's actually a beautiful room. I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. Oh, thank you. Ah, and it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of <gasps> Oh, I got some. Always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. You have a note desk of description used to reveal magic properties of unified gear while you've collected. Oh, dear Lord. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. Definitely, definitely. So, what did I get? 51. Increased damage with Patrifius Totolus. And that's a Gryffindor. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. 39, no treats applied, and they're both the same. Nothing new there. Okay. This one is level 20. Aww. Aww. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. I sure will. Yeah. I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes. The magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Okay. Conjuring spell. Conjure naked girls for me, please. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. Okay. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase. Yeah. They can also be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I got plenty, baby. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Hmm, quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magic okay. and brew potions in class. How many new spells I'm unlocking suddenly? Uh, conjuring. Uh, let's put it right there, I guess. Oh, you can build it yourself! Oh, oh yeah, baby! What is this? Bionicle Station. Right, right here, I guess. 
Ooh, you can't choose what you want. That's that's gonna be a pain in the booty. That's gonna be a pain in the booty. Like right there, I want. Okay, not there then. Right there. A bit further. Oh. Okay, let's put it uh, right there, I guess. Oh, I don't have the budget, really. What do you mean I don't have the budget? I have the budget. Okay. Oh, you can... Oh, you can disable... Napping mode. Gotcha. Okay, I'm confused what to do now. I think I've done it then, yeah? Da, 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 da. That's a bit too big. How about we place it right here? Everything is locked. You've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside. There's your description. I already have one, but I can move it around. Okay. Four rules playing cards. Six rules of playing cards. Where can I place it though? Playable space. Oh, it's on the wall. But how, where do I place? Right there. Oh, okay. This is amazing. Quidditch board. I cannot already select that much. Location. Oh, rugs. Ancient books, cases, gothic book. Oh, yeah, gothic. Mm. The room is kind of tiny, though. Not gonna lie. I wish it was bigger. Decorations. Gryffindor! 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 Blank frame. I don't need that for now. Can even sit? Tables? Statues. Hippo. Hippo. Why do I have Hippogriff statue? Where do you pl place it? Ah, oh, okay. This will be a perfect spot. Come on. Right there is a perfect space, though. I'll put it at center then, I guess. And that's it. Deke will be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. I'd like to know more about Deke. A bit more about Deke. He's been at Hogwarts longer than I have, and seems to know it's every nook, cranny, and secret. We discovered this room together when I was a student. Deke has had a good deal of experience, both here at Hogwarts and at a previous post. I shall let Deke tell you more when he's ready. But again, you would be wise <coughs> to listen to any suggestions he may have. Okay. Can I use this type of transfiguration magic outside of the room? Conjuring and vanishing are strictly forbidden elsewhere in the castle. We've charms in place to enforce that. Oh, that sucks. It would be exhausting to reverse the errors in both judgment and magic. But the room of requirement has its own rules. Well, that's a shame. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. Well, well, well. This is amazing. Speak to Professor Weasley again. Okay. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Very well. First, you'll need to get <coughs> a moonstone. 
You can acquire it by vanishing items here in the Room of Requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. I already got plenty of moonstones. Once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin. I got loads of it. I have the moonstone you requested, Professor. Good. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tales. Okay. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? Okay. So, F1. Number three. Ooh, I unlocked way more. A long mirror. Ooh. There's no space. Uh, that's a long mirror. Okay, then. That's a very tiny mirror, not gonna lie. Regs, uh, Gryffindor, Gothic, like Botanical, Gothic. Like, I don't know, right there, I guess. Decorations. Lights, I don't need lights, it's pretty light in here. Paintings, I don't need paintings right now. Um, maybe this, like, right there on my desk. Oh, nope, you're not allowed to have it on your desk. Let's place it right here for now. Can I uh, pick it back up? I hope you can pick it back up. Oh, you can change your size. Ooh. <laughs> Here, for Dub, for, for Deke. There, Deke, you can sit now. <laughs> a table. That's a very tiny table. That's way too big. Uh, okay. Like, how about right there? Can I pick this back up? That's a question. I want to pick it back up. Seasonal. Oh. Can I pick this back up? Liviosa. Huh. I want to pick this back up though. You can't? Uh, I guess we'll do a painting of a witch portrait. Does she move? She does move. Oh, dear lord. Good work. Shall we move on? Yeah, we can move on. Sorry about that. I've conjured everything I can. What's next, Professor? I think you're ready to take on alteration. The altering spell will allow you to customize any conjured item. Oh, nice. You can change the colors, patterns, and styles of your furniture to suit your taste. Let's get started, shall we? Watch closely as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. Altering spell. Alternate this little booty like this side. Hold on, girl. Hold on, girl. Any conjured item and perform the altering spell to customize. Can I move? Oh, I can. There we go. Um, I'll put it right there. You go over there for Doby. Uh, Deke, sorry. Uh, cancel, confirm. Can I change this? No, you cannot change color. Ah, uh, I see, I see. I want to change this color though. Blue, okay. I don't like red. I mean, red is my favorite color, but I like black. Oh, that's cool. Can I change this color? 
Oh, that's cool. Ah, that's cool. No, I don't want to. I want to finish this. Wait, what's the, what's the difference? Small pot, scientific botanical. Is that the same? Small pot. Wait, hold on. Scientific botanical table perfect for growing plants. Growing plant that requires a small pot. Electric potting table perfect for growing plant requires a small pot. So everything is the same. So I can just choose what I want. I like this better. I want to change this color to black. It did not change into black though. Yes. Uh, what's happening? Okay. I want to change this. Oh, you can't. That sucks. This is freaking amazing. I want to change this though. To black. Yes. I don't see anything changing though. Now I want to change this. This is freaking cool. Okay. I want to change this color. Not red. I want black. Oh, sorry. Color black. Yeah, that's already done. I choose any size of item. I did that already. I have some questions about alteration, Professor. Yes. Well, Thank you, Professor. I have no more questions. I already done I'll it though. If you need anything else. I already done it though. Okay, then I'll alter this chair to be bigger. There you go. Done. Now you're ready for something a little more advanced. Okay. Use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Yeah, we done Try that. New designs on the floor or balcony. Try aiming at the floor or at that balcony. I want to change the floor for 100%. That's slithering, kinda. Hmm, I kinda like this. Your space might benefit from a bit of ambiance, don't you think? Yes, I do. Would you mind? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Where are you? Mr. Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. I don't see you. I think she'll enjoy it. Oh, there you are. Uh, come and talk to Deke when you're ready. Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience? Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? Mm. I like something natural and earthy. I focus on room dark and mysterious. A moonlit. Natural and earthy. I'd like the room to feel natural and earthy as though I'm outdoors. Oh, sounds perfect. Uh oh. Nothing changed. Oh, it's just the, it's just the ambiance. Nothing else. Okay. Mm, quite a difference. Of course, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Okay, thank God. You have learned a good bit about alteration. Thank you, Professor. The room is full of possibilities. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, the room always manages to surprise me. Uh oh, oh, that's the exit. Oh, it's a different room. I can, I can have multiple rooms. Okay, that's good. Holy schnitzel. Uh, can I live in here, please? I don't want to be there in the common rooms anymore. An even bigger space. How did that happen? 
The room equips itself to your needs. It must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting. If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spellcrafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. Use it wisely. Oh my god, it's amazing. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> Alright, it's locked. It, it, it was bigger. Oh, it's this side. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Whoa, I can train now. Wah, wah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, guys, I'm going to customize this baby. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Don't forget to drop a like, comment, and above all, subscribe if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.